Hey everyone, and welcome to this video. Today, I'm at Kenny Upal, located in St. Catharines, Ontario. And in front of me is something kind of rare, kind of un kind of that I don't actually know if I've ever seen one in real life. I've heard a lot about them, but I don't think I've ever seen one until now. And this is a fine example of one. This one is a 1992 Chevrolet, che Chevrolet Silverado, or as I prefer to call them, Silverados. <laughs> I won't call them that for you guys. Um, this Chevy Silverado, some of you may see a telltale sign already of that, came with an option back in the day, which was a diesel. This truck was a plow truck. And that's probably why it's here, because it probably got beat to hell being a plow truck. But this, I could just smell it walking by it. Um, I love the smell. This is a diesel. This is a 6.5 turbo diesel. I believe it's turbo, at least. Or is this a 6.5 naturally aspirated? Hmm. This might be a 6.5 NA. Yeah, this is a 6.5 NA. This is not turbo diesel. <clears throat> Anyways, so the 6.5, it's actually nice tires to, and maybe not so much. Uh, the 6.5 was a, it's kind of a dog. It was slow. It's kind of not great. It looks like this one was taken care of. New alternator. It's very oily under here. Holy crap. But it was a plow truck at the end of the day. <clears throat> the bed looks good. Actually, the bed looks fantastic. Oh my gosh. This bed is mint. On this side, at least. We'll take a look at the other side in a minute. Tailgate's mint, too. That's not perfect, really. This is not that bad. This box, someone had a plan to restore this truck. They were planning to restore this truck fully, and I, I firmly believe that. Because the bed is mint. It's got overspray. This was a southern bit, for sure. Wow. I want to rescue this truck bed. There's another one that's halfway decent right here, too. Not as good, but still really good. OEM front rear bumper and really, aside from the little dent over there, it's in really good shape. And... KO2s all the way around on, I believe, 16s? Yeah, 16s. All right, back up to the front again. Now, this truck here, it's impressive. They, this one made it a long way. As you can see, the rockers are all but there, and you can see that whole corner moving. All your switches. The interior door panels are in good shape, but uh, this does not have the extra door. See the rear seat's a little dirty, but it's not that bad. Manual select four wheel drive, of course. Has an aftermarket radio, of course, but it has 737,941 kilometers on it. That's a lot. Has so much. It's obviously been a work truck too. Like that's it made it. This truck does not owe anyone anything. I will say this much. I want this bed though. Thing's solid. I hope someone rescues that. There's been a little damage, like this line here needs replacing still, and obviously it wasn't perfect, but this thing here. Looks like it was well taken care of. 
And this is what I love to see. Some pe people take care of their vehicles. Um, 740,000 kilometers almost. You gotta be taking care of it for it to last this long. And well, I hope someone rescues a lot of parts off this thing. Anyways, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button as well as subscribe for more. Have a great day, everyone.